My secret is a secret that has haunted me for many years. It is a family secret, which we all have. The reason we all have family secrets and the reason we try and keep it a secret is because it's often something that brings shame to the family. And my situation is no different. Um, my mom tried to keep this secret from me and my two sisters for a long time, um, for as long as she could. She was afraid for me personally, it would damage uh, my career goals, my dreams of being a broadcaster, my reputation. For the record, I did get her okay to tell this secret. Um, let me start out by showing you a very, very old, old family photo of, okay. You will notice there are That's a lot a big of family. And this is only a fraction wow. of my family. If you look at the center, that is my grandfather there, okay. my mom's dad. And the reason my family is so big, my secret that I have been harboring for years is that my grandfather was a polygamist. He had nine wives, six of who bore him children. He had 11 children that we know of, countless mistresses. Now, if we look at that old photo again, and if you look two heads to the left, that is my uncle. He was the second son to my grandfather and he had 20 children with four wives. And had he not died in a freak car accident when he was 42, he probably would have had more wives and more than 20 children. Um, now let me say this. I never got a chance to meet my grandfather. He died before I was born. He died before my mother even got married. All I knew about him growing up was that um, he grew up in rural China, dirt poor, dirt poor. And he had a rags to riches story that started out in China, got him to Rangoon, Burma, and ultimately got him to Singapore, where he died of lung cancer at age 62. So he could have had more children and more wives had he lived. As you can imagine, this was extremely hard on my grandmother, my mom's mom. She was his first wife. They were in a prearranged marriage. So this was not the man she chose to marry. It was the man who was chosen for her. But you have children with this man. You grow to love this man. And then you see wife number two come through the door. Number three come through the door number four, number five, not all the way to nine. The last wife was younger than my uncle, the firstborn son. Um, my grandmother thought of leaving. You know, it's gotta end, it's gotta end, it's gotta end. Yes, it's gonna end. This is the last wife, I promise you. It never was the last wife, right? My grandmother couldn't leave. She had three kids to feed. She didn't even know how to read or write. Um, it was hard on my mom. It shaped my mom's uh, image of the institution of marriage. I think it's one of the big reasons why my mom did not get married until she was almost 30 years old. Mm -hmm. And this is back in the 60s. Mm -hmm. That's, right. That was unheard of. Um, I also believe it is why my mother at age 17 found Catholicism. She was looking for answers, and she decided she wanted to become a practicing Catholic. Mm -hmm. I also think it's why she chose to marry my father, who could not be more opposite than who mm -hmm. her father was. Mm -hmm. My parents are coming up on 52 years of marriage. And they raised three kids. Um, and I think it's also helped shape, I didn't get married until I was 34. Mm -hmm. Um, did you talk about this when you were growing up with your family? Did you always know? About no, it? it was always this weird, vague thing. Like I would go back to Singapore to visit cousins, and I'm like, 
that cousin doesn't look like me. You know, like, because yeah. my, my grandfather's wives were of all different nations in Southeast Asia. Oh. And I was like, wow, like, that cousin's really dark, you know? Right, right. Or like, I don't, and we don't look alike. And it, I found out afterwards, it was always this weird, deep, dark secret. How many wives did he have? Nine. 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 But only six gave him kids. Wow. And they all knew about each other. They all knew about each other. They all lived in the same home? No. My mother never knew which home her father was coming home to. Wow. She didn't know if weeks would go by if she didn't see him. Mm -hmm. And, you know, on his deathbed, he, he apologized to my mom. Oh, okay. So. Wow. That is, an, that is a doozy. I know. Wow. Families. Yeah. What are you going to do? You can't pick them. You can't pick your families, but you got to love them, yeah. you know, warts and all.